Hello, everybody. This is Diarmuth of Almost Cool playing here with Math Jazz. Hello. And Swarmlord39. Hello. And we are continuing our uh, Stellaris playthrough. This is episode three, if I'm not mistaken. You're not. Good. I like being correct. It doesn't happen often. And I and um, unless anything we want to say, I'd say let's just get let's just get this going. Alrighty, I'm good with I'm good. With, let's go then. Okay. Yay. So let's see. How many more days until I get that colony ship? I have less than two months before Dude, I get my colony ship. How is that happening? What? All of a sudden, my influence dropped to minus two. Um, I'd run over what you've got. Oh, if you're, are you a millet? Let me see, what are you? Uh. Part of it is because I said a free migration. Oh. Part of it. Wait, free migration? Another thing is, another thing is, um, my edicts allow, I do, I usually do encourage free thought in one of the other research grants. Why do you uh, encourage free thought if you're a military <sighs> dictatorship? Because, it, because it speeds up my research. Oh, okay. Uh, the other thing is, because I'm in a line, I get a minus one, and because I have a defensive pact with someone, I don't remember who. I think um, it's me. Probably, but I'll check in a second. Uh, I get a minus two influence. No, we all have a defensive pact. It's because we're in an alliance. Speaking of which, I realized we never actually named our, uh... Alliance? Our alliance, yeah. It's called the Righteous Entente. Who wants to yep, change it? Defensive pack. I'm okay <laughs> with just about anything you guys can name it. Uh. Well, the thing is, the thing is, when we look at what we all, when we look at all of our. Uh, all of our different, like, ethos and governments and whatnot, we are nothing alike. So, oh, it's like World War II. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I don't mind. I, I don't mind. I guess we can leave it at that unless we come up with something we think is better. Yeah, pretty much. That sounds fine with me. Or, heck, uh... Construction complete. Maybe, we're, maybe we might end up getting... <laughs> Who knows, maybe we might end up getting a comment sometime before we do the next round and we can do our, uh, we, we might be able to take some suggestions off comments if there, there are any. Yeah, maybe, we'll see. Anyway, I'm about to send, I'm about to colonize my second, my, uh, I'm about to set up my first colony. Me too. Not yet. My I just colonized Hixar. Evading I'm colonizing Tukvan 4. There are hostiles in Saldar, just so as you know. Yeah, we had there were a bunch of hostiles around, but we got our fleets wiped because we didn't coordinate very well last time. Yeah. <coughs> you lost your entire military fleet, and I lost most of mine. Speaking of which, I at least want to re rebuild a. I at least want to get two more. Get back to my base of three corvettes. Alrighty, hostiles and Mulsir. Yeah, it's best not to tackle. I'm heading to take care of that, actually. Woo! I I have I have set up the colony Grand Chapel. A great day for the Church of Larangia. And what's more. This is the first world that will probably have multiple species on it, or multiple in, multiple intelligent races on it. Wanna know why? Why? It's a guy world. Okay. In other words, it's a world that's 100% habitable by every by every intelligent race. So once it finishes setting up, then. Uh, then that that migration treaty, I'll probably end up pulling in some of the, 
I might end up pulling in a, a citizen or two from your from your guys' empires. We'll clear that set of slums. Green crystalline entities. Oh, yeah. There are actually four varieties of crystalline entities. Green, yeah, blue, green, red, red, blue, violet. Green, purple, blue, and red is actually the order of weakest to strongest. And then there are the elites, which are kind of all sorts of colors and ha actually have a another special um, little thing that you can grab off them. Have you, uh, killed them off in Molsir? He's killing him now. Do the green ones heal themselves? Are you guys lying to you? Uh, yeah, I just... Oh! Math! You are heavily lagged at the moment. I'm gonna pause the game. See if that... See if we can let... See if we can catch it up. There we go. Is everyone caught up with everyone? Uh, I'm on... 4-7. <laughs> Four seven. Four six. Huh. Want me to try unpausing it still? Oh. Yeah, Math, you're lagging behind four, pretty badly. Four eleven. I'm on fifteen. Sixteen. Fifteen. Eighteen. Hey, you're lagging several days behind. Nineteen. Twenty. Uh although it you are now stuck on twenty two according to according to mine. Twenty four. There you go. Twenty seven. There you go. You're catching back up. Sort of. Ooh, what did I get? Geothermal fracking. <coughs> oh, you almost got him. Yep. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. So. Anyway, as I was saying before, the laggy you popped up. With the exception of the mining drones, all um, the uh, spaceborne, all spaceborne neutrals actually can automatically regenerate. Okay. Well, yeah, but, because everything else is sort of fleshy based. Sort of. The crystal entities are different, but yeah, they're grown compared so to the drones. I have a question. Mm hmm. Molsir three A. Is 80% habitable by me, and Molsir 2 is an arid world. Who can live on arid worlds? Uh, I can't. And I don't think... And I don't think Diarmu can either, if I recall. I claim Molsir. Yep. <coughs> okay, Molsir is yours then. Uh, yeah, what's the... here is, uh, dang, where is it? That's the one you just cleared out. 60, yeah, it's 60% for me. Yeah, because he can, he can, yeah, you have a 60% on Tundra Worlds. I'm about to finish setting up my... I'm trying to increase the size of my army and heal the one here, heal what, heal mine. And I'm trying to get the blue lasers right now, so I'm making it a little more dangerous. It takes too long to colonize. You mean setting up an entire an an, an entire the uh, core of an entire new planet? Need take the take the fact that it takes a year is too long. Yes. 
All right, then. I don't believe so. I mean, early on, it's a nuisance, but early on, everything is a bit of a nuisance. It's, uh, once you get to later on, that, that, that small, seemingly, that's, that amount of time starts seeming, sm seems small. Two more months and I get a plus one to my monthly influence. Nice. I'm currently working on uh, alien visitor centers and improved spaceports and administrative AIs. Nice. I mean, I'm. I mean, as a spiritualist, I'm doubt. I doubt I'll end up going down the full artificial intelligence route, but. Administrative AI is a, yeah, is a very decent one, at least. Just straight up 5% research. Hey, how, do you, how do you go down the AI side? Or is it just essentially robots? Uh, well, spiritualists have robots outlawed completely. Uh, as, um, as their starting bit. Why is that? Um, robots don't have souls. Yeah, the closer you get to artificial intelligence is the closer you are to getting to making a mockery of life and the soul and all that sort of cr stuff. In return, they get they get very easy access to psionics. Well, it's still though. lagging for some reason. We've been sitting at the same day for a bit. Oh, you're you're sitting at six, and me and Math are at nine for some reason. Which is weird because if I'm because I'm looking at my you know how above normal speed it says the date. Mm -hmm. Mine says, it says 8 right there, but below it says um, 6 for some reason. <coughs> okay, I <I've, coughs> paused the game again. I must be out of sync because I'm still... Because... Oh, you've caught up, and now we're all going again. That was off. And you've immediately fallen behind. Uh... I don't now, know. Now why am I at sick? What's up? Uh, well, we're going decently well, all things considered. Alrighty, how many more months? Three more months and I will have that system under my control. I need to take out these void clouds in a dash sheet. Or what power? What's their what's their power level? One eighty-five. I can beat that if you like. I'll jump in with it too. I mean, it it is in my territory, so. I have no military. Well, uh, yeah, I and I can't I can't really afford to spend the minerals it? on it. Um, so it is g north, galactic north of my two colonized systems, right between them, as well. What are you talking about? Research a dash, but however you pronounce it. But yeah, that's it. I think. Yeah. Well. I mean, if I can get if I can get rid of those. I mean, uh, just just a little just a little above Nord under Nordak. Yeah. All right. There we go. All right, I'm on the way. By the Yay. way, my fleet power is 242, so this should be so this should be relatively easy. Yeah, and I've got. A, I mean, <laughs> I can't take it on my own, but I can at least give a decent contribution with my fleet power of 81. Well, that's the nice thing about ganging up on someone is while they're focusing on my fleet, you can always hit them and they won't attack you. Yeah, I mean, also I should have longer range than you at this point, because you've only got lasers and I've got missiles. I have a new museum of exobiology. Ooh, nice. I still need to get the habitable world habitable world survey. I think you But I did I did discover these in I did discover remnants of a precursor civilization. Nice. Oh man, that that, that hyperspace 
that hyperspace lane just kind of sucks. I mean, so the opinions don't do anything when you're uh, human players. Yeah. More or less. I mean, opinions are ways that you have to work with computers and get the computers to side with you. Um. <clears throat> Whoop. Alrighty, I now have my first... I now have my first colony beginning. And holy nice. smoke, it is amazing. Take a look. You guys can look at the planet if you want. I found... I found a long dead race of aliens. It's in the. Um, is it the uh, Vol Voltum? Situation log update. Um, I'll have to check. Oh, alrighty. So yeah, the plot. Ah, oh, fudge, fudge, fudge. Okay, remember when I said I was gonna help? I can't. I got it. Don't worry. Uh, I just have. I just had a bunch of pirates just suddenly spawn somewhere. That's me too. Where did it say? Did it say where they spawned? Fuck! In the Zune system, in my home system. In your home system? Yes. Uh. Hostile fleet. Oh. No, I. <clears throat> ah! No! 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 Crap! Crap. 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 Crappity crap. I found... I found... I found, I found some, ra some raiders jumped into my system. Oh, we appear to have frozen again. Station under attack. They're attacking my mining station. Oh, uh, you got them to. You have your own set of, uh. They're called Raider Malays. I've they're got, blowing up one of my mining stations. I've got the ghost flotilla of the. I've got the ghost flotilla attacking me. But, but, but where did they even come from? They, they just randomly spawn. Yeah, I know, but where do they show where is their where is their system? They have to show up from somewhere and Not necessarily they're but actually yeah, they are pirates. They do they do have to rotate from somewhere. They have to have a base somewhere. That's the problem. I have no idea where this base is. I think that I can afford to leave these hostiles in system that survey. They'll stay in the system, right? I not always. Mm. I don't want to have to waste money on some Corvettes. But here go four ah. of them. Oh, go you idiots. Don't just sit at the edge of the system. Attack! What? I need to start researching more military weapons, but I actually have to unlock the ability to get said military weapons. So thank you for clearing up that system, by the way. Oh yeah, totally. Uh, am I gonna get there before my mining station? Right now, I'm trying to get there so I can get the, so I can do the research for it. Ah, the special research. Project. Oh, I found the pirate base. I can oh, that. I found their pirate base. Okay. Well, um, uh, fudge, do I update this, upgrade this now? No, I need, I need a few more Corvettes before. So, unfortunately, this is one of those times where. Oh, fudge, we froze again. Oh, wow, uh, I may have desynced with you guys because I am way ahead. Guys? 
Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. I was wondering if I had disconnected because. By the way, I'm at Talk Vaughn. I'll help you out with that. All right. Uh, it appears to have unpaused again. But math is still behind, so it's still frozen. I'm gonna pause what, it again. What can we do to make this work a little better? I don't know. I mean, I don't know, it says it says that all of us are on the ninth now. Really? Because I mine says you're on the sixth, Matt. Yeah, same. Oh, now you're on the ninth. I don't know. There I, we go. I haven't seen any problem from us being a few days apart from each other. Yeah, well, the problem is once it gets a certain, once there's a certain amount of, uh, once there's a certain gap in the days, it just stops. Just, just remember, um, don't don't worry about taking too much damage. Just deal some and then run, okay? Well, I'm just, right. I'm primarily just saying that. So yeah, you I, don't have to, I know. So you don't risk damaging your feet too much or losing some. Uh, froze again on my end. Looks, looks like I'm a little behind. Well, I'll one far, at least. I don't know. It, it says for me that I'm on the 29th. No, it was uh, DR mood this time. Okay. Yeah, that yeah, this is a little odd. Whatever. Uh, let's just. How are we doing on the time for this? Uh, twenty-two minutes into the episode. Cool. Is there a dedicated server program out there for this game? Uh, not that I know of. I, I can look into it at I can look into it after our recording session. Okay. Uh, crap. Dear mood is falling behind again. Still. I oh, wonder why. Pause it. Did you catch back up? Have you tried playing with the plus and minus keys in the top left? Sorry, top right corner of the screen. Yeah, are we all going normal speed? I'm going normal speed. Yeah, mine says normal speed too. Uh, should I drop it down to slower, maybe? Think that might help? Um, I am unsure. Let's just drop it. Yeah, let's just give it a try. The worst that can happen is nothing happens. Be helping a little. I don't know, is it better? Uh, it's well, be running a little better. A little? We haven't actually froze. I was about to say, we haven't actually frozen, and then we froze. Looks like only you, dear Mood, have the power to change the speed of the game. <laughs> Ooh. I got some research off that. So did I. And my space t and my little mining station survived. Like, barely. Okay, so on the plus side, I also know where they're, uh... Oh, fudge! What are... No, 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 no. You are not going to finish surveying the system. Not until that space station is dead. Fudge. I don't know if I like playing on slow mode. It's already kind of a slow game to begin with. Well, part of it is that we keep is that it's not actually helping with the freezing bit. Yeah. As far as I can tell. We it froze seemed again. like it, but it but that might have been a random chance that it wasn't that it was working all right. Yeah. Hold on. Um. Maybe I should try switching my uh, network connection. Would that I mean... To... I well, we might... could do that between episodes. 
Okay. We can always cut this, we can always cut this one short. Uh, you know, if we ever unfreeze from this point, uh, because we appear to be stuck. That's true, we do appear to be stuck. As far as I can see, we're still paused. What about now? Second. Because mine says... Still, well, there we go. Yeah, mine says we're on pause, but nothing's moving. Because, uh... Yeah, I'd say let's just cut this... Let's, I'd say let's just cut this one short. Okay. Uh, if we're having issues, then there's not much we can do about it. Yeah. Okay. But some stuff did happen, so... Wasn't, wasn't we researched bad. a few things, we lost a few ships, we got attacked by space pirates everywhere yep. at the same time. And Yermu dominated. Yeah, you did. You, got, <laughs> you, you you didn't lose your fleet, you got a really decent fleet going. It's coming along. So. Alright, All well right. then. Go ahead and take us out. Alright everybody, I hope you enjoyed episode 3 of us playing this wonderful, wonderful, oh, generally good game cool. called Hello, Stars. wait, just unfroze. I'll go ahead huh. and pause it, though. Because uh, we want to try and fix this problem completely. Yeah, so, um, again, this is us playing episode 3.